A recent study found that when men of color are teachers, the outcomes can be dramatically better for many students. I got to see this firsthand with some promising next generation teachers. So I need eyes on me. First grade is in session at PS 181 in Brooklyn and guiding their lesson is Kadeem Hector. This is my drawing. What do you think it is? What do you tell someone who's thinking about doing this for a living? Oh my God, I, I say go for it. If you can give a kid the energy that I give every single day, go for it. Mr. Hector just graduated from CUNY's NYC Men Teach program. It was started in 2015, designed to get more young men of color on the teaching track and into classrooms. He says helping his mom raise his younger brother gave him inspiration. But they see a black man yeah. in the classroom. Yeah. How much does that mean? It means a lot. When they ask me questions, I know it's because like they feel a, a definite connection to me. Yeah, how does that make you feel? Like I feel like I'm living in my purpose. Nationwide, just 2% of K-12 to classrooms are led by black male teachers. But here in New York, William Anders, University Director for NYC Men Teach, says the local statistics tell a different story. The hiring rate for men of color in 2015 was 8% uh, in uh, New York City. And what's it now? Uh, we are currently hovering 17%. And CUNY Chancellor Felix Rodriguez says the retention rate also says a lot. Over 95% of them stay after the first year and 80% of them stay after five years. Right, so it's a great investment for the city of New York. Rodriguez is leading by example as the first Latino man to head this 175-year-old education institution. You keep opening doors for those who come uh, who come after you. Data shows that if students of color have a teacher of color in grades three to five, their dropout rate before graduation can be reduced by up to 39 percent. You're more likely to stay in school. You're more likely to be engaged in school. You're more likely to enjoy school. All these different things are so positive just by your presence. I'm hopeful that they have this memory and if they, they're on the cusp of not going to school anymore, they remember me. The Teacher Opportunity Corps is a program at Teachers College at Columbia, also designed to increase the number of teachers from underrepresented backgrounds. Jason Flowers is a recent graduate teaching music. I think when my students look at me, they see something that they can relate to. They see opportunity. Darius Phelps is pursuing a PhD in English education at Teachers College. And for some of these kids, you're more than just a teacher. You're a dad, you're their older brother, you're their best friend. And for me, that's the most fulfilling part, too. Back at PS 181, Kadeem Hector has been offered a full-time position next September. And that is sure to make seven-year-old students Taylor and Nathaniel very happy. Mr. Hector, does he care about you guys? Yeah, he yeah. does. How do you know? Because he always had like a smile. One time I was walking home and I saw him and he gave me a, a big smile. Adorable overload, right? CUNY says it has a solid support system in place to keep students on track from peer counseling to financial assistance to even helping out with Metro cards for students who just need that extra bit of help. Role models goes a whole long way.